Hello again, and welcome to my stage, your platform. My name is Susie, if you are new to this channel, and I welcome you all. If you missed my last review on the Montclair Parnaba long down jacket, make sure to check out that video in case it may be a jacket in the style you've been searching for. I will make sure to leave the link of that review below in the description section of this video as well, as I did with the Canada Goose Snow Mantra boots. All right, let's move on to today's review on the Canada Goose Mystique Parker in the black label and in the graphite color. But before we get into further details on that jacket, I want to acknowledge the packaging of this jacket. From today, just after holding you in my arms for the first time with tears in your eyes. Like all Canada Goose jackets or clothing, the Mystique Parker came packaged in a hard black box that bears the brand emblem in the middle. The jacket inside the box was neatly folded, as you can see in the video, and was accompanied by a complimentary. Canada Goose hanger carefully placed in the shoulders of the sleeves. It also came with a black garment bag, again with the emblem or logo in the middle. The garment bag also has snap buttons on each corner, which I really appreciated because I thought to myself, hmm, this snap button garment bag should come in handy when traveling with the jackets to the airport. And I don't mean to reiterate on this, but it is also great to have to store away your garment after the winter season or when not in use. I am not sure why, but I always appreciate even the tiniest details and effort people put or should I say companies like Canada Goose, Nobis, Moncler and other luxury brands put into making sure that the price tag feels like it was worth it that you just purchased something of class and great quality. Oh, by the way, um, besides the snap buttons, the garment bag also has zippers to store away things like accessories or whatever you choose to use that space for. So hush, my little child the box you will also find a black envelope with an itemized receipt of your purchase and a card loaded with information on the guaranteed lifetime warranty provided by Canada Goose if your jacket should ever fail due to manufacturing defects Canada Goose will repair your jacket free of charge or may choose to replace it there are very few exceptions on products like their knitwears and accessories but all jackets and most of their snow boots have a lifetime warranty. However, that shouldn't give you the carte blanche to mishandle your jacket, okay? Before I move on to the jacket itself, like Moncler, Canada Goose also gives you a return slip in the form of a scan. All right, so let's finally go into details of what makes this jacket worth the $1,450. Although this Mystique Parker comes in so many different colors, I chose the graphite because they no longer carried my size in the black with the black label, which was my initial or preferred color to the red label. You can still get a black Mystique Parker in a size small online, but only in the red label. An extra small in black with the black label is available online. Although I can comfortably fit into that extra small, I wanted a jacket with a bit more room for layering if I choose to do so. So I think the size small was a perfect fit for me and a perfect choice in the graphite. I made a wish from today just after holding you in my arms for the first time with tears in your eyes you looked up at me and knew it's all right cause you are my you're my joy you are my you're my heart you are my you're my everything you are my 
of my life. I was lucky to have found this graphite color in the size I was looking for. This jacket, by the way, is not meant to be layered, hence the durable textiles used. I wasn't sure if I was going to like the graphite color, but in person, this color is much, much more beautiful with the black label. The graphite color is not as dark as you see on the Canada Goose website. It is a bit lighter. This right here in this video is the exact true color of the graphite. And I simply just love, love, love the simplicity of the black label. Just like the black Mystique Parker, the graphite color surprisingly matches everything I paired it with. And I mean everything so far. I was going to return it if after receiving it, I didn't like the color, but I fell in love with it. I fell in love with a graphite color. So it stays. <laughs> anyway, plus this particular style of jacket, the Mystique Parker, is made for minus 30 and below degrees weather. It is field tested for the coldest places on earth with a thermal experience index number of five or TEI of five. The thermal experience index ranges from one to five, with one being lightweight, two being versatile, three fundamental, four enduring, and five extreme, which was what I needed because of how very painfully cold I get during the winter season. With the TEI, you can confidently choose the right Canada Goose product for your body, your activities, and your lifestyle. So, before checking out of your shopping cart, take a look at the Thermal Experience Index to make sure it will accommodate your needs. The TEI-5 works perfectly for my needs. Now, did I mention how much I love the length of this jacket? It goes down my calves and the sleeves are longer than most jackets with a knit cuff closure. Although I wished that they had a loophole for my thumb like they have designed on the Alistair Parker, which has a TEI of four and not as warm as the Mystique Parker. Now let's discuss the pockets on this jacket. Jiggy up in here. That's right. Ah, ah, ah. It's Friday, and we want to create stories we can share on Monday, right? So get your feet ready, because we're about to. There are two exterior fleece lined hand warming pockets and two interior security pockets with zipper closure and drop in pockets with a Velcro closure. I love the front fleece pocket, they keep my hands warm and can also hold small wallets and keys comfortably. I will not put my phone in those pockets unless they are small ones like the flip flap ones, or is it flip flop, flip flap? Yeah, you get the point. Like the very small ones that can flop out, flip, flip. Okay, let's move on. Um, so the two interior pockets are bigger than the exterior one. So that's why it's best to put your phone in the drop enclosure pocket on the left, which is supported by Velcro. Um, that should definitely fit your phone completely and comfortably. Some people complained about where the pocket sits on the hip or on the waist um, of the jacket, but I actually love it. I love that it sits high. In my opinion, that was brilliantly designed. I feel a lot more relaxed and comfortable once my hands are placed inside. I realize that my hands feel a lot or a bit rested. My shoulders relaxed and my posture 
straightened up. So for me, this works a lot better this way than the traditional side pockets we are all used to. Also, you should know that um, when zipped all the way, the neck can feel a bit stiff at first, but loosens up with time. If you have a longer neck, this should not be a problem for you at all. The zipper is strong and sturdy, but doesn't easily catch at the bottom and takes a few tries to engage to zip up. Still, this is not a deal breaker for me considering the amount of warmth and comfort it exerts. This parka is made for those who will be going out no matter what in any kind of winter weather, sap, zero and all. The fabric is very heavy duty which makes the jacket a tad bit heavy. Heavier than the Montclair Parneba long down jacket for sure. Maybe it's because this Mystique parka is made of 625 dug down or it's because the carefully quilted through design promotes even heat distribution without adding excessive bulk. The interior backpack straps can be used to carry the jacket over the shoulders on days that the temperature suddenly rises. If you're anything like me and like simplicity, you will be appreciative of its hands-free design. Just have yourself a wonderful Friday night. The recessed rib knit cuffs adds comfort and locks in the heat and the storm flap underneath the two-way zipper keeps the elements out. You can unzip from the bottom for added range of motion or venting. This jacket, like all the other Canada Goose jackets, are made in Canada with some domestic and imported materials. This jacket is mid-care for superior protection. If you're 5 foot 8, 5 foot 9 and above, it might be slightly above your mid calf. Don't forget that this jacket is by dry clean only, so that can be something to factor into the maintenance aspect of it. Remember also to remove the fur rough before dry cleaning it, all right? Since it is designed to stay dry in extreme conditions and cold climates, the heavy duty durable textile contains cotton, and according to Canada Goose, because of the cotton in the fabric, the color of the jacket should naturally change and build character over time. It is a water resistant jacket and if you care to know the origin of the fur, it is from North America. The hood, although not as big as the Montclair Paneba long jacket, is a downfield also so it adds warmth and element protection to the neck. It can however be removed. The fair rough, as you can guess from the video, has a shaping wire which is great for protecting the face and is able to stand up to harsh wind. Now, I'm not sure if this parka will be restocked with Coyote Fair in the future. My guess is I think that this will be the last batch of Mystique parka with real Coyote Fair because Canada Goose is officially going fair free. 
but oh i'm just super crazy about this black label and it works so well on this graphite color it is just simple it blends in with almost everything i'm thankful that i was able to get the black label in my size and uh, not the red label although the red label looks very nice too it's just that i I would rather be low key a little bit and so that's why for me this works perfectly for those curious about the authenticity of the jacket in case you bought it from somewhere other than directly from canada goose rest assured that canada goose since 2017 has a hologram label sewn in all of their product as proof of authenticity it should feature a polar bear image and elements that can be seen from all angles so buyers beware if your jacket doesn't have the hologram, it means you do have a counterfeited version of a Canada Goose jacket. It's time for some freestyle. I see you, mommy. You too, puppy. Here we go. <laughs> So far, we've been very lucky with winter this year. Global warming, guys. Global warming is upon us, everyone. It's here. And as much as I hate the cold, I don't want winter to pass us by at the expense of this beautiful world of ours. But people who will benefit more from this jacket will be those who live in Scandinavian countries like Norway, Finland, Denmark, Iceland, Sweden, and so on and so forth. Also, people in the northern parts of Canada will benefit greatly from this jacket. And of course, our good old upstate New York, Minnesota, Green Bay, Alaska, and even New York City always makes the cuts because of how cold it gets when winter truly graces us with its presence for real. And when that happens, having a jacket like the Mystique Parker on hand, on standby, always helps. If you truly wish to cover all the winter safety bases, Try pairing this jacket with the Canada Goose Snow Mantra Boots, the Arctic Down Mittens, Canada Goose Tonal Emblem Ear Warmer, and you, my friend, will be on cloud nine as the Human Thermal Cold Weather Terminator. <laughs> How crazy me, the things I come up with. One thing I forgot to mention is that Canada Goose is kind enough to provide us with different fittings. What I'm wearing in this video is a classic fit. It is longer than the Fusion, which is a tad bit shorter in the sleeves, and overall, the length is also a bit shorter than the Classic Fit. The Fusion is great for people 5'5", 5'4", or people who are really petite in general. I find this jacket to be true to size, so there is no need to size up if you don't want to. I just wanted a little bit of room and not form-fitted. Remember, it is meant for you to wear over thin layers and not to layer up so you can get your size and you will be okay if you want a little bit more room then you can do what i did and get a size up all right because this parka is plenty warm and for me for the first time as you can see from this video i don't need to layer up a ton in fact i am standing right now in a sub zero degrees weather in this video with just a long black sleeve and a t-shirt like you're seeing right now Oh, and I also had on a pair of leggings and on another day, which was also a sub zero degrees weather, I only wore it over a black long sleeve and a pair of leggings and I was just fine as you saw prior. I was fine. And let me just say this, that I was so warm that layering up, I believe would have been a very big mistake on my part. You saw me wear this over a pair of denim jeans also with a denim jacket worn over white long sleeve shirt on a minus 30 degrees weather and I still had enough room left to move around comfortably even after zipping up completely. So for me, yes, it is a good choice to have that option to layer up or down. Some of the issues that people complain about on this jacket is the fur. Most people think it isn't fluffy, but take a good look at this yourself. It is very beautiful and it also feels very full to me. Doesn't it look fluffy enough? How much fluff can one person have in their life, huh? Look at it. I think it is as fluffy as it looks on the model. It feels very full to me and I really love it. I like it very much. Um, 
I really don't have much to complain about when it comes to this jacket because it delivers. It does what it promises to do and that is to keep me very warm in harsh weather conditions and it is doing just that. The fur is secondary to me. So if you ask me if this is worth $1,450, I would say yes. If this is the only jacket you have in your closet, you will still be fine and it has a lifetime warranty. So all you have to do is to take very good care of it and Canada Goose will do the rest for you. It is really beautiful. It keeps you warm. You don't have to layer up. If you want the puffy look, then Montclair Paneba down jacket, something like that is what you need. But if you want something more form fitted, but yet still warm and classy, then you want to do Canada Goose Mystique Parker or any of your other Parkers. Just make sure that their thermal experience index number five for extreme, especially if you get cold so easily. You want to be warm. You don't want endurance, which is index number four. You want number five, which is their warmest. To sum this up, this jacket is heavy yet flattering and slim fitting. It is warm yet breathable and comfortable. I don't want to layer up, no problem. It's got me covered. And because I got the size small instead of my usual size extra small, I have plenty of room to play to choose to dress up or down. I love it very, very, very much. Just as much as I love the Montclair, but the Montclair, remember, is a different look and a different style. All right, but they're both good and you will not go wrong with either of those jackets or either of those jackets. <laughs> okay. No matter what you do, just have yourself a wonderful Friday night. I have about covered everything under the moon and sun when it comes to the Mystique Parker, uh, but I meant to share one more vital information with you all. On Valentine's Day, BBC reported that armed robbers have been targeting people for their Canada Goose coats. So please be wary of your surroundings when you happen to have yours on. They rob people in public. They don't care where or when. So please be very careful. If you must, give them the darn jacket and report the incident immediately to the police. If you can look carefully at them, do that and give the police a good description of what they look like and perhaps your jacket could be returned to you when the perpetrators are found. Till next time, be safe and smart out there. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope this can help you in making an informed decision before taking that plunge or next step to invest in a very beautiful, durable, warm jacket. If you are new here or have not yet subscribed yet, do not forget to hit the button on the right side below this video to be notified of any future videos like this and others. Remember, it's free. Leave all comments below in the comment section. You can also email me on mystageY at gmail.com. Thanks for watching and I will see you all next time on my stage, your platform. Bye-bye.